If you guys like how I do my chart analysis on YouTube and you want to learn how to do it yourself, click the link below to check out the VTrades technical analysis course. What's up traders? This is VTrades and today I'll be doing a technical analysis breakdown for Palantir Technologies with the ticker symbol PLTR. If you want a chart analysis guaranteed to be done, please read the description below. Also take a second to give the video a like and subscribe for more chart analysis. I appreciate it very much. This video is for entertainment purposes only, does not constitute any financial advice. I will first go over what I see in the daily chart and finish the video off with the weekly chart. It's been a while since I looked at Palantir Technologies, however, nothing has really changed. We are still continuing to trend down lower. So let's take a look at the more recent price action on this daily chart. You can see that we got back below the EMA, uh, which is not a good sign. Uh, there was a nice rally up, but we cannot find any support by the EMA. Uh, we pushed through it now we're finding resistance on the top side you can see that we're finding resistance from it and now we're selling off so it looks like we're selling off in this potential downtrend channel that's working lower so this looks like the channel that prices are respecting um in the short term i expect this gap to be filled this empty space on the chart right around that ten dollar and seventy cents level uh, once that gap is filled i'm expecting a pullback to this side of the channel which is the resistance side and then more selling i'm really looking for a new low of this downtrend to be hit uh, just because we got back below the ema and we have not had a uh, a new low of this channel that was the mi the macro channel in play we have not had a new low of it so there's a high probability to get a new low of this uh micro excuse me macro channel so that's why it looks like prices are continuing to turn over and sell off until this target is reached which is right at the nine dollar and probably the $9.76 level. So that's my uh, near-term target. I think there's a high probability for this to be reached, uh, especially how bearish things are looking in the market. And I don't think Palantir is any exception. So let's take a look at a potential measured move in play. You can see that this was the first target that prices had. This was the first move down. This was the second move down. Once we hit that measured move, we saw a lot of buying. We saw a big pullback in the market. However, we're still continuing lower, so most likely they want to continue uh, to lower price levels. So we're going to do a bigger measure move now. So where is my target that I have for Palantir, which is past the lows of this down move, downtrend? I would say it's right at the $8 level. So that's my target that I have for Palantir. Um, I'm surprised it's hanging up this well compared to the stock at SoFi. I feel like they kind of trade the same and this one has, has been holding up uh, much better than so far however i think that's not going to last for long uh it does look like prices are um trending down and i'm looking for these lower price targets to be hit first one at the nine dollar and 76 cents level and then the eight dollar level i highly doubt the longs who have their stop losses below the ipo price or around these levels are going to be safe it definitely looks like the market wants to stop out all the bulls who have the stop losses back here uh, before we start seeing higher prices or a reversal so i doubt they're just going to reverse from here and continue trend higher when there's a bunch of buy orders that could be um, hit over here so looking for those people to be stopped out and then we'll go from there so let's go ahead and wrap this up on the weekly chart and here we have the weekly chart for palantir you can see that on the daily chart we had that massive pullback and on the weekly chart it shows you why we got rejected because the ema was acting as resistance we got rejected now we're selling off it does look like short sellers are targeting uh the lows of the sw um, swings right here which is right at the ten dollar and 43 cents level and then right around that nine dollar and 76 cents nine dollar and 76 cents level however i don't think uh price are going to stop right there i really think they want to target the lows of this entire chart which is right around that eight dollar level so i'm looking for a new uh, low of this entire stock to be hit um, I don't think it'll be safe um, as of right now. So I'm looking for these lower price levels. If anything else changes, I'll give you guys an update. Thank you for stopping by and checking out my video. Make sure to check out the rest of the channel since you might be surprised what you can learn. Leave a comment down below on where you think prices are headed. Also share the video if you want your friends to learn about the markets. Lastly, I appreciate any feedback to help improve the channel since I want to deliver great content to you guys. See you next time and bye.